G'day everyone, welcome back. Hope you're having a great day. It's Friday here in Australia and I have another food bank haul to share with you all. A special shout out first though to those of you watching over in Hawaii. Aloha, thanks so much for watching my videos, I really appreciate it. And if you haven't let me know already, drop me down a comment below and let me know whereabouts in the world you're watching from. I'm always interested to hear. If you're new here, this is a $10 food bank run by a local church in my area. Uh, it's available to anyone in need. Anyone in the community is able to go along. Uh, it's one where you pay your $10 and you then pick up a box of groceries that have it set out on tables. And along with the groceries, there's usually some cold or frozen items. Um, most weeks there's bread, sometimes there's eggs, and there's usually some fruit and vegetables, depending on what's available and what's um, plentiful in season. So I'll give you a closer look at what I was fortunate enough to get this week. Uh, first of all, I got a packet of spaghetti, which is great. I also did get a can of baked beans in rich tomato sauce, which is very helpful. Uh, we got two cans of the whole peeled tomatoes this week. And there was a can of green peas. There was a jar of Vegemite, even though it says pizza. <laughs> it's just a promotional label. It's a suggestion of what you can use the Vegemite for, I believe. So I don't know about pizza, uh, pizza with Vegemite. I suppose it would taste all right. Vegemite and cheese usually goes pretty good together. So that'll be great. The kids will like that anyway. Uh, there was a can of spaghetti in the rich tomato sauce as well. Uh, there's also... A can of mixed vegetables and a can of sweet corn which is great. Uh, this week there was two jars of sauce. Uh, there's a Napolitana chunky tomato and herbs pasta sauce and then there was also we haven't had these for a few weeks quite a while now um, some chicken tonight mild butter chicken sauce. So that was all the canned and jar items. Uh, there was a few different types of snacks. There's some Cruscuits original crackers. And again this week we've got some bluey pizza flavoured snacks, which is great. This is an eight pack. My kids will love that. Uh, there was also some LCM bars, the bubblegum flavour. Oh no, I beg your pardon, it's not bubblegum flavour. So I used to get a bubblegum flavour. It's Cocoa Pops. So there you go. So Yeah, they're all Cocoa Pops. So there you go. And we've been getting bubblegum flavour. So. <laughs> so my kids will like that. That'll be good for a change. And there's a one kilogram bag of long grain white rice, which is fantastic. And there was also a bag of organic during week wheat <laughs> uh, spirals as well, which is which are great. These are really lovely. These these spirals. We've had them before. Uh, in the cereal department this week, we got a box of Kellogg's Just Right. Um, this one's a it says Fusion, crunchy granola and cereal, almond and cashew. So that's a different one. I've never tried that. Looks good though. So that'll be nice. And to go for the cereal, we got two almond milks. And these ones have been really, really good. We've been getting them the last few weeks. Really creamy. Yeah, very, very nice, these barista almond milks. So two of those. And we also were lucky to get a box of the Cadbury cake bars again this week. And these were pretty tasty um, when we had them last week. They didn't last long, so yeah, everyone will like that again. Uh, in the cold items, we got, this week there was three ready meals. There was a battered fish and vegetables, which looks pretty good. And there was also 
potato gnocchi with pumpkin sauce. This one's my favourite. It's really, really good. When you heat them up in the microwave, the cheese melts and it's really delicious. The gnocchi almost tastes like they're homemade. They're whoever um, makes them, yeah, they do a really good job. So that, that's a great one to get. And the third one is a honey soy chicken and noodles, which I think we've had other weeks as well, which is a, a pretty decent meal as well. So that was nice to get those three. Uh, there was also a bag of frozen items from the local bakery that donate. There was two meat pies. I think it's a meat pie if I can see through the plastic. It might even be a little quiche. Sometimes they have quiches. Well, it might even be a quiche. Um, and a sausage roll as well. So that's great. And there was also a loaf of bread. This week it's a Viva wholemeal high fiber vitamins and minerals sandwich loaf, which is pretty good. And there was a selection of fruit and veggies as well that we were given. There's some lovely looking little apples. These will be perfect size for my kids' school lunch boxes. So four little ones, a couple bigger ones. And there was three onions. Uh, about four potatoes, quite a big zucchini, a little bag of green beans. Uh, there's about five carrots there and about half a dozen ripe bananas as well. Yes, that was everything I was fortunate enough to get this Friday from the food bank. And it's a big help to us here. I think I did pretty good again for $10.00. It really does make a difference um, being able to utilise my local food bank. It just helps my grocery shopping money go that bit further. Uh, I don't know what I'd do without the food bank at the moment. It's an immense help to us here. And if you're finding your budget's pretty tight and you're watching your money and what you spend, please don't hesitate to seek out and find a local food bank or food pantry in your area. There is links below in my description box. So thanks everybody for watching. I hope you have a lovely weekend and until next time, take care.